Mr. Mojo short tutorials. Today we will talk about SEO. Over the course of the next few videos, we will walk you through different SEO settings available in your Instamojo store and how to leverage them in order to rank better with organic search keywords. For part 1 of this series, we will start with the basics. We will be covering what is SEO, why is it important and how can you use basic SEO settings on your Instamojo online store. Search engine rankings are very important for getting traffic to your store and that is where SEO comes into play. The higher you rank, the better visibility you get. To make your store optimized for search engines, you first need to focus on three things. Meta title, meta description and meta keywords. The first step is putting in keywords. Take keywords as general search terms that your customers will be using to look for your store. You would want to identify 4 to 5 such keywords relative to your store in order to improve your ranking. Don't worry, we'll be putting in some links to keyword planning tools and SEO guides in the description below in order to help you out. The title is the first things that your customers see and tells them what this page is about. Remember to keep the title under 60 characters. Let's move on to the last step, the page description. The statement below the title is called the page description or the meta description. This description is a brief explanation of what the page consists of and has a limit of 160 characters. In order to edit your SEO settings, follow these steps. Step 1. Log into your Instamojo dashboard. You need to be a premium store user in order to use the SEO settings. You can buy the premium subscription by clicking on subscription plan and choosing the best plan for you. Step 2. Find SEO on the left hand side panel and click on basic SEO. Step 3. Enter the relevant page title, description and keywords you've decided on. Once you're done, click on save. Pro tip. Make sure your primary SEO keyword comes at least once in your page type and page description. Congratulations, your store is now SEO friendly. We'll see you in the next video of the series where we'll learn more about some advanced techniques of improving your SEO. Stay tuned.